Hey, my Capricorns, happy birthday to us again. Um, I'm doing the bonus read for the most views for December the 21st to the 25th. Um, Capricorn came in at 726 views, so we was number one. Um, so I'm always doing a bonus read. As I told you before, once I put all signs up, whoever emailed me first will get a free personal read. I would just need your name and birth date. You could reach out to me at RCV Real Estate Broker, which one O at gmail.com. It's also in my description box. You could also go to my Instagram if you can't, you know, do that that quicker. It's double underscore my underscore time underscore number two underscore shine is instagram you could follow me or whatever you want to do or send me like listen was i the first one and if you was the first one i'll let you know and i'll do a free read and i'll have it for you within 24 to 48 hours most likely 24 though because i'm kind of fast with it um but anyway yeah it's capricorn season my capricorns and i know y'all like hey yeah wow car won't fall out was balanced yeah, I need to stay balanced in what I'm dealing with. But you know us Capricorns, we always balance. So I'm going to say, universe, spirit, guy, holy angels, please bound up all the evil, hate, jealousy, third evil eye, gossip, and envy people have for us because we stay the fuck on top, bottom fucking line. In the divide, I always pray. Amen. Yep, I definitely heard amen again. Um, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to use the big Morgan Greer deck, which is my favorite, came out to be my favorite. And I'm going to see what God want to tell you through me or tell us through me. I hope everybody have, you know, a good Christmas or had and have a great New Year's. I want you to take the resonate. And as I always say, which y'all be knowing, other signs don't need God to rest. If it ain't your story, keep it moving. Or it could be somebody else. But don't squish in parts. It could be some parts, but don't make it you. You feel what I'm saying? So, we're going to see what's the energy that's going to be around us. Because I know I'm having, like, all positive energy around me. I just became a grandma, so I kind of don't even want to be around today, people. I just want to be around my snuggles. Because she's pure from the gate. I ain't. She ain't tamed or stained. You be having motherfuckers walking around like they call they, they y'all y'all friends supposed to be this and that and they around to stuff in your back in with another person. People crazy. That's why they stay miserable on the left. Not me. I'm done. I ain't got time for people. Fuck all that. I was to deal with my friends from back in the day. That's it. But anyway, listen. I'm about to see what's going on. Ain't none of my cats getting married. Or some of y'all already married and wish y'all wasn't. I know that's the fuck right. Or the other ones like, I ain't getting married, I'm doing me. I know that's right too. People don't understand our loyalty. We're loyal to the fault. We kind hearted. We love, we love hard. People is ignorant. Men and females. Bottom fucking line. Okay, I'm about to go ahead and see what's going on here so I can eat my delicious food weight loss weight loss journey I'm almost there and I'm going to get my surgery soon I won't talk about it bottom of the deck is not building it could be you're not building your pinnacles up. It could be that they already built up. It could be you ain't building a relationship or situation. But to whatever it is, you're not trying to build nothing. And it might be you just won't want to build with somebody. It could be another earth sign as well. Cap on Taurus and Virgo. So we want to see what's going on. Why are we not building? What is the energy for my Capricorns? Universe, spirit, guide, holy angels. Please let me read these meanings accurately, officially. And you I always trust. Amen. Her amen. What is the energy surrounding my Capricorns at this time? This is a bonus read for most views for December the 21st to the 25th. What is the energy? Mm. Okay, Capricorns, Sagittarius energy. Past something was built on a faulty foundation. They came tumbling down. 
It already came down. Now you got to build from the rut. What was it? What was it, my Capricorns? What was it? For us, it's usually, with Thunderbolts, it's usually somebody was trying to play us. In any type of partnership, friendship, or relationship. I ain't going to just say relationship. People be trying to play us in friendships as well. And the fraud shit just came out. And you and you was done. I feel you. Me too. Crack the fuck up. Let's see. What's the energy? Mmm. Eight of Wands. Neo, Sagittarius, Aries. Somebody was sending you messages or something in the past. Or 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 the tower moment hit quick with messages. In the past. Somebody was sending you messages. They wanted to make a lot happen. Even after the tower moment came down. Could have been dealing with a Leo, Sagittarius, or Aries. What is the energy surrounding Capricorns at this time? What is the energy surrounding Capricorns at this time? Choices. Confusion in the past. Couldn't make a choice. Couldn't make couldn't make a, a right choice about a situation. Confusion in the past. Cancer Scorpio Pisces. Emotions attack though. Okay, yeah. Seven of Swords. Somebody felt defeated. Somebody lying. Jealousy. Envy. Hate. Yep. We get all that. What's the energy? Wow, wow. Hmm. How that crossed over that. Knight of Swords. Truth and clarity cutting through some bullshit. But prior to that coming, you had the Six of Wands of crossing. Crossing you. Which they say is a fell victory in something. Fell victory. I don't know if you had a fell victory or something or somebody else did, but it was a fell victory. Something was going on with these wands. You just dealing with a Leo, Aries, or Sagittarius. Let's go ahead and keep going. Yeah. Eight of Swords. You was feeling bound up, trapped, can't see. That's how you probably was feeling in that situation. Swords represent Gemini, Libra, Aquarius, Air. What's the energy surrounding the Eight of Swords? Hmm. This is deep, but you got the Emperor crossing you, which is reversed. So you could have been dealing with the Aries, mean, nasty attitude that you wanted to grow something with. A new beginning. It could have even been a pregnancy involved in this. That was from the divine. I'm going to leave that right there and go get some clarifiers on the little cards. Yeah. Sound deep already, don't it, Capricorn? And that's your future. So we're going to clarify this tower. Why is the tower? Mm. Something ended permanently. Yeah. When that tower moment hit, that Scorpio energy, it, it, it ended whatever was going on here. It's an ending. There's no going back. Let's see. What's the energy of the tower? Yeah. You got the fool. Don't take that chance. Maybe you knew you shouldn't have took that chance and you did anyway. That's what I'm getting. You seen you knew it was gonna be that tower moment, Capricorn. We knew you took that chance anyway. You took that chance. They were sending you text messages fast. Everything was coming fast. Everything was going fast and great. Uh-uh. You was an option for this person. They had all these other choices, Bill. Yeah. You ain't know that, though. Because they were dead how they was coming. But it was an end as soon as it started. And don't take that chance. You knew that. But this is from the divine. Don't take that chance. You may already took that chance. But it was already written. Ain't nothing to worry about. It was already written, but we're going to see what the jealousy is coming out. Seven of Swords. What's the energy surrounding? Oh, wow. Ten of Pentacles. Somebody see you as a Ten of Pentacles. Happy, money in order. You just living life. 
So yeah, you are gonna have jealousy. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. You could even have somebody that's that side like that that that's jealous. They see that you stable. They jealous as hell. Look, imagine somebody seeing you with all of this. Look at that. This is how they see you as. They jealous. You see them in the back talking all that bullshit. They jealous as shit. They haters. They mad. They mad as hell because they see you. Yeah. That's that's what's going on here. We're going to see why this Six of Wands reversed for you. What else going on? What is the energy? Yeah. Fell, the fell victory is because they try to get away with some bullshit. Bottom fucking line. Look at this with this episode. They try to get away with some bullshit and it wasn't happening with you. Not with you. Not with you. They got away with some. You see, they laughed a little bit. You see? But you cut right through that bullshit with truth and clarity. You came through quick, too. And you came out for blood. You wasn't for that shit. And this your present energy because the way this is looking, this person might try to come back. And is letting you know it's an ending. Don't take that chance. I don't know how they going to come. They might come disguised with all types of these gifts. But it's telling you don't take that chance. So we're going to go ahead. We're going to see for the future. You got the Eight of Swords. Why you got the Eight of Swords? You shouldn't feel like you bound up because you don't supposed to take no chance. I see. Why is the Eight of Swords here? Okay. You move too fast. Chariot. This is a cancer energy. You move fast in a situation that the world wasn't even in your favor. And you, you move fast towards something with somebody that maybe was like a page. Or you may have seen somebody like a page. You move too fast. You move too early. Page is young, early, too fast. In some type of situation. And you got the emperor crossing you. So, yeah. You move too fast towards the Aries, mean, nasty person. They just too much. Let's see. What is the energy? Oh, my God. Capricorns, don't be mad at me. Like, don't be mad at me. I mean, it is what it is. Going over top of this emperor that, you know, how he is, don't tell the truth. You got the tower. Something built on a faulty foundation is going to come tumbling down. With the eight of wands reversed this time, everybody going to go in different directions. It's saying everybody going to go in different directions toward a new beginning to make something happen. It's not going to work. You're going to take a chance. That's what it's saying. You're going to take a chance. This reverse, I could reverse these roles because it's like you already dealt with this in the past, but they're going to come to you another way and you're going to take this chance here. And it's going to be the same thing again. I'm going to clarify the Ace of Rods for you. What are the energies for the Ace of Rods? Eight of Cups moving forward. You're going to move forward with the new beginning. Let's see. What's the energy for the Ace of Rods? Knight of Cups. You're not going to take that cup of love, though. You're not going to take it. You're not going to take that chance, maybe. Let's see. Uh, this is somebody that a quick thinker could indicate police. Somebody spying on you. This person is spying on you. They thinking of the right time to even come in with their bullshit. And it and they and this could be you coming up out of having a lot on your shoulder. You're not carrying no burdens or none of that no more. And they see that. They watching that. They seeing you happy. They on some other shit. I'm telling you that now. Let me go ahead with the page of swords. What's the energy? Yeah, the hangman. Somebody is um coming up out of being just standing still, basically. They about to they about to move forward. What is the energy with the page of swords? Yeah, you got the page of rods. Somebody will make something happen. Somebody like a page. You, this is how you look at this person. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. I'm telling you, your reading is like really direct for 14 minutes. But listen, don't take that chance because you got the death card. It's, a, it's, it's done. There's no going back. Even though it's your past position. But like I said, you could put the future, the past to the present, the present to the future, the future to the past. You don't know. You got to really listen to this video here. I'm going to get you a love oracle. What is the energy for my Capricorns, my birthday babies? Regarding this reading, what's the energy? Kisses. Unconditionally loving. 
giving and receiving affection, falling in love. You may fall in love, but I hope not with this person that the divine just said that it's an ending and don't take a chance with because they ain't going to do nothing but get away with some shit, try to get away with some shit. There's a lot of jealousy going on, and this may not be from this person, or it could be. This person could be the one that's jealous and envy. And he going to try to come, or she, to get away with some shit. Because they see you happy with the Ten of Pentacles. And if you do, it's nothing going to be a failed victory. Once again. But it's like you're going to cut through that bullshit. Right from blood. So they talk about kisses, fall in love. I hope they may be falling in love with you. But I hope you're falling in love with somebody else. Bottom fucking line. Because you don't need that fucking bullshit. Let's see. What is the energy? What is the energy? New beginnings. Bottom fucking on. As you should. New beginnings. Leave past friends, past men, past partners. Leave all them people in the past. Where they belong. The past. Get you a chocolate oracle. What is the energy? For my cappies at this time. What is the energies for my cappies at this time? It says acceptance. Accept the shit that you can't change and just move forward to a new beginning. Please. That's how I take that card. I'm going to go give you last oracle. What is mm, okay? You was trying to come and take you too. Beauty ritual. Start beautifying yourself. It's our birthday season, which that's what we do. They saying that a lot of us need a health checkup. It's time to get a checkup for the new year. And then you have use your hands. Be more creative, which I do. So that's what I got for my Capricorns for the bonus read. I really appreciate your likes, your views. I got my comments off, so I don't have to. I don't. I don't like. I wouldn't argue with the audience and all that, and you know, customers and all that. I I can't get into that. When I read, I just want to read. I don't care what you your what your input is, because I know my read. So I'd rather just have lights and stuff. Maybe they the one I do all that, but right now, nah. So I appreciate my Capricorns and y'all just really shit, cause I know I am. That's just what we are. We just. Beautiful in and out. We're something. We something that others just can't think or can't touch. Even if they try to be us, they just can't. They don't have that in their soul. They need to just stop. I hope all of you have a great birthday like we're at. And a happy new year. And I hope a lot of new beginnings happen for you because me too. Like this reading I could resonate for is giving me a warning sign as well. But, uh, listen, something in and in. Because they ain't going to do nothing but try to play you again. That's all they do. They Some people feed off of other people hurt and pain. Always remember that. Need a motherfuckers where they behind. And it don't matter if somebody is the same sign as you or, like, in the same bracket as you. Like, Capricorn rules the earth signs. Them motherfuckers be fake, too. So, you know. Watch all of that, too. Motherfuckers don't be you. You is only you. Capricorns, we're, we made, God just made us a one of us. And nothing could ever copy us. We're, uh, we're of God, literally. People don't understand it. But we really are. Really are. When I was reading up, people really, we, we really gods, basically. But people won't understand that. So I leave that alone. But listen, you have a safe birthday. Because I don't have no idea what I'm going to be doing. I don't know nothing. I just know my birthday, I want to just have some alcohol. Because after that, it's over. I just want to wine. But I don't want all that. I don't want to be all tore up and shit for days and all sick. I want to get some wine. Expensive wine. I want two bottles. And I just want to just have fun. With who? I don't have no idea. I, I That's what I'm fo figuring. Who I want to have fun with and just wild out with and just have some fun. Because a lot of these people born. So I got to figure that out. 
So Capricorns, you know how we do. We always do the, oh, the spur on the moment tip when it comes to certain shit. Because we sneak you in that. So, peace, light, and blessings. Happy New Year to my lovely Capricorns. And also, happy birthday to you.